Wesley Bryan on the last par five he'll see today. Sixth. Saw him drive it in the creek on this hole a day ago. He had driver in hand then. He's got fairway wood now. And a look at where that tee shot from Wesley Bryant ended up here at the par five sixth. The only good news here is if you need to make a restroom stop, <laughs> pretty close. But still, I mean, you can measure it out. So he's out there. Don't move the ball. Okay, so my nearest point. Well, no, you got to get your hands out as well. Right. Six, you know? When you hit the shot, is the club not going to go through the water? I think it's a little bit further back. Okay, I'm okay with that. Well, I mean, I might as well just drop it over here and then just measure because I'm yeah, screwed over I here. mean, look, you can, just, you, can just, you can measure. You don't have to put the ball on there. Just measure right. and see where you are. Now he's got a car, a van moving. Oh. He's taking another drop. Making Robbie work a little bit. Yeah, but if I drop it right here, this is the point you have to measure one club length and drop it within the second. So if you want to drop it closer to the you need to measure with a different club. You guys, y'all are so finicky. Now you have to just drop it on the Okay. How about we all turn the other way? We'll do whatever you want, man. So when you're taking relief from a okay. obstruction, you, you, gotta take, you get to a point where your nearest point of full relief, and then you go more than one and club length yep. from there. So he had to go drop outside of the one club length. That's where all the rules get kind of squirrely, and that's why I always call the officials over. You know, very important time to call one over. That was confusing, and the thing is, Wesley Bryan. The camera guys are gonna have a chance to get inside maybe the cut line that we think it will move to with the weather like it is, maybe two, maybe three over. Back to back birdies coming into this par five. Now he's got to move some cameras. Yeah, with four holes to play, and he if he can you know, squeeze a couple more birdies. Can we just go ahead and move this man too? Yeah, I just a little bit. And Wesley Bryan now. Driver off the deck. Oh boy. Come on. Oh. Please. Show cooked it. <laughs> That's a hard shot to hit. I've never seen a driver off the dirt. I mean that was uh that was a, that's a hard shot to hit there. And what do you see? I chunk hooked it. Almost took out a couple spectators. Look at this. And Paul, the idea here is the driver off the deck is supposed to cut. Ideally, yes, he's looking for a low bullet cut right through that gap right here is where he's looking, trying to work it off of there. And look at it start left. Uh, even though he's got, he's still mathematically in this thing, you know. He, I'm sure he's feeling like, okay, I, I, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm blowing this thing up here. Be careful. But he's still in it. He's five over. Cut's going to probably move to two, maybe, you know, if the wind picks up and stays up. He's there. He's only lying two. 61 hole. 61 hole? Yeah. 25 front? Yeah. Is it right on that little knob back there? Yeah. Kind of little, so. got some upslope in front of it about 52. Let's see if I land on 30. That's good. Contact is key here. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Why not? <laughs> How about that? You know, he hit a good one earlier in the day out of the pine straw after he hit a really bad one out of the pine straw. Look at that, right junk, moving cars. 
Wesley Bryan on this hole hit it, I would say, a zip code right. Yes. Behind some toilets. Moved two courtesy vans, took two drops, hit driver off the deck, into the other ropes and the pine straw, and now has a short, short look for a birdie. Well, here we go. Wesley Bryan, this for birdie. <laughs> birdie, birdie, birdie. That should be an illegal four, but it was a four. We haven't seen you. The greatest hole play in the history of the game belongs to Wesley Bryan. From the unknown to the dirt outlying to five feet to birdie. The shot tracer of this should be the background of his Twitter page. It really <laughs> should be. It's just unbelievable.